And now our tale of the tape for this middleweight championship fight. More than a decade separates these two fighters when it comes to the age, with some differences in height, but big differences in reach. Once again, here is the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, it's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Middleweight Championship of the World! Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist with a professional record of 13 wins, 3 losses. He stands 6 feet tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Coconut Creek, Polona, presenting the challenger, Yoel, soldier of God, Romero. And now it is the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 15 wins, no losses. He stands 64 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Ladies and gentlemen, the reigning, defending UFC middleweight champion, Israel, the last defender of the All right, this is for the championship bout. I want you guys to do a clean fight. Follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Good luck tonight. Touch gloves. This is a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right now. I'm very excited. All right, here we go. UFC middleweight championship is on the line. And just misses with that big right hand. Adesanya gets absolutely melted by that head kick. Check that one. And he lands the roundhouse. Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that time. Oh, he tags him with the straight hand there. Nice job by Romero. Checks the leg kick. He just tagged him with that uppercut. He's got to be careful not to run into things, though. Trying to establish that jab. Nasty leg kick lands. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Covering off doing a nice job of stopping that ground and pound. Brutal strikes landed from the full guard. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Lands a good shot from the bottom. And busy as he looks to improve position here. He's in half guard. Full guard here. Well, you gotta stay busy on the bottom. He's doing it here. Nice punch. Well, pretty good work off of the bottom here by Adesanya. Beautiful hammer fist. Hard elbow to the body. Showing some good defense here on the ground by controlling that arm. Working from full guard here. Missed that shot. That one hurt. Just missed with the left there. Oh, beautiful, beautiful right hand by the champion.
Trying to establish that jab once again. Strong work with the inside leg kick. These guys are swinging. Just over two minutes to go in round one. The right and the left behind him. Unable to land with that punch. The soldier of God gets caught with big that left punch. Up. This could be it right here. The champion is in big trouble here. He is in danger of losing his title. Leg kick checked by Adesanya. Takedown defense has held up thus far. Sage work here defensively. Double leg takedown, no good. And stuffed. Pummels under. Maintains the under. Body shot. Beautiful throw there. Good control, postures up. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Well, just because you're on your back doesn't mean you can't throw offense. Staying busy here, you'd like to see that, Joe. Inside control once again. Good punch. Well, hard to win fights in mixed martial arts from the bottom, but nice work here in that position by Adesanya. Caught him with a punch. Oh, and now an elbow up top by Romero. Good punch. Oh, that's it. That's oh, it. Beautiful knockout. Ground and pound KO. Yeah, Joe, the finish comes courtesy of some outstanding ground and pound. And it's one thing to try to score when you have your opponent in a compromised position on the ground. It's another thing to try to end the fight. And that's exactly what he was trying to do here tonight. Elbows and punches and hammer fists, one weapon after the next. And ultimately, the knockout materializes. Nicely done there. And here we see it again. Boom! And that is all she wrote. And there is the UFC middleweight king. Best fighter in the world at 185 pounds. What a knockout he turned in here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Amasaki is called to stop to this contest at 4 minutes, 28 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and new UFC middleweight champion of the world. So some UFC history tonight as we crown a new UFC champion. Congratulations to fighter and team. And man, are they going to enjoy this one. A lot of people not giving them a chance coming in here tonight. And this is a moment that at times people just thought we wouldn't see. New champion here tonight. The longtime incumbent is out. There is a new sheriff in town in this division. And it is going to take a big performance to dethrone 